At this time, I would like you to welcome a special guest to my lab, a neuroscientist. I would like you to welcome Dr. Andre Viscontis. Hello, Andre. Welcome to my lab. So great to be here. What have you been working on? So I'm really interested in how the brain works, how we see things, how we make sense of the world. Do we always see things exactly the way they are? Absolutely not. In fact, we, there are such things as illusions. What's an illusion? Well, I brought two types I'd like to show you today. I, I brought you an optical illusion and a visual illusion. An optical illusion and a visual illusion. All right, I'm ready. Yeah, you ready? OK, yeah. so I got to set it up over here. Set it up over here. I'll okay. get out of your way. Thank you. All right. Oh, I'm going to do it this way. So an optical illusion is an illusion where there is something in between your eyes and what it is that you're looking at that changes how you perceive that object, OK? So first off, do you see two arrows here? Yes. OK, are they pointing in the same direction? Yes. yes. OK, are we sure about that? Do I need to adjust them? OK, pointing in the same direction? Yes. yes. All right, what happens when I put a glass cylinder in front of one of them? Nothing. They're still pointing in the same direction? Yeah. Well, that's not very exciting. OK, well, what happens if I pour water into the cylinder? It changed direction. But again, the only different, the only reason is because there's something in front of our eyes and the thing that we're looking at. So that's so an optical illusion. That's an optical illusion. You want to see a visual illusion? I would love to see a visual illusion. So yes. a visual illusion happens entirely inside our brains. There's nothing between our eyes and what we're seeing. It's only the brain that essentially creates the illusion. So do you see these two red lines? Do they look exactly the same? No. no. One of them looks longer than the other, right? Which one? The one on the right. The one on the right looks longer than the other one, but if I move it across the screen, you'll see that, in fact, it's exactly the same length. Sorry, that looks a little weird. Let's put it down. There we go. See? Same length. But when it's over here, your brain interprets these lines as indicating that this line is actually further away from us, so it must be bigger. Our brain creates the visual illusion. That's fascinating, Andre, really fascinating.